the most unexplained and creepy camping videos. Hey Slayers, we are back with some creepy camping videos. These videos are unexplainable and creepy and frankly, too frightening to watch. Before we get started, be sure to like the video, subscribe with notifications, and share it with your friends to see if they are brave enough to watch. Number 8. UFO Sighting The universe has always been a fascination to mankind, but it is just as terrifying to discover aliens or signs related to their existence. ...of a UFO. I didn't alter it. I didn't Photoshop it. I've got four shots straight up out of my camera. I will swear under oath these are the original shots from my camera, and I don't know what they are. UFOs for sure. Let's take a look in today's episode. A family is having a usual day at their house when the father supposedly spots a UFO or alien ship of some sort. That's for what it is. Go out, Mark Katie. Just so you know, I please. Just... Now I have to find it because it's just Wait, can you go closer? Can you go closer? This was, a, this was one of those last ones. No. Homestead Howe posted a video on YouTube on June 18th, 2021, showing the pictures he took while filming the starry night sky. Original photo out of my camera. Zoom no in. Line. Go to. No, 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 no. no. Go to. Look, does that look like an airplane to you? No, it looks a like a A helicopter, a drone? It is like a red It's not my drone. Looks like okay, the watch. Worst. Watch. Here's where it gets scarier. Watch this. Watch. Oh, shoot. Look at the light coming off. Emma. Oh, I, oh, I showed this to Alyssa. He mentioned that later that day, there had been a thunderstorm. And after that, he spotted a UFO. See the house with stars. Okay, yeah. crap. Oh, what the heck? Oh, oh my gosh. There's little lights. There's little lights. I'll show this on the screen, too. Humans Here, I'm going to take, take a screenshot. Oh, right my now. gosh. Best your freaking move. Taking a screenshot right now. So I'll show that in the video. And then I'm going to revert to the original. And I'll show this in the original. I don't need it. He claims that the pictures are raw and not altered or edited. He took four photos in which the flying aircraft has reflective light beneath it and seems like a UFO. Okay, here we go. We're cropping into the... This is the clearest one. There, that's a helicopter? Is that a helicopter? Does it, like little scenes. Like, look, you can see stars behind it. If this was a helicopter, wouldn't there be like a thing here and this and then a propeller? And, and then a person? Because this camera zooms in far and you can you see... see a window oh, here? Look, like, that looks like a tiny part where the conductor... The more you look closely at these pictures, the more you believe it's a flying saucer. It's gonna abduct you. It's like, abduct. I don't know if that's a spotlight or if it's just so bright that that's all the light coming down. And then we walk up and... Was it really a UFO or photoshopped? Does this confirm the existence of aliens? Share your comments. It's overhead and nobody cares. Yeah, guys, guys, Jen's guys. Like, oh, it's a helicopter. Isn't it? Air 51 is the escape place. They won't let you escape. I don't know. Number 7. Pokemoke Forest YouTuber CJ Fazan was camping alone in the allegedly haunted forest of Pokemoke and has been a well-known explorer of such places for quite some time. Has something evil haunted this woods? I kind of keep my bearings about me because I don't want to get lost. stories have been associated with these woods, like murderers, spirits, and demons. In this clip, he will be seen spending the night in this forest alone. Okay, so not gonna lie, my biggest fear right now is the hook man. It's Before starting his adventure, he mentioned a famous urban legend about the forest of a hook man who killed somebody with a hook on his hand. Okay, so that was a complete and utter fail. So we're just gonna keep on walking and trekking through these woods. 
I hate that the spirit box. It Little did he know it would be a long night for him. set up his tent in a random spot where the woods seem dense. He takes a walk hoping to record something interesting and stops to check the spirit box that captured some voices. He walks a distance and sees a flash. Wait, is it the hook man? And put us, it was the dumbest thing I think I've ever done. Turning his lights off and sitting there quietly seemed like a good idea to him. So he sits there for about 25 to 30 minutes, hoping for that mysterious man to go away. Listen to me, yep, no. when he is about to return to his tent. Something falls from the trees, and he makes a run for it. <gasps> oh! Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh! He gets to the tent and later spends some time trying to communicate with spirits through the spirit box. Are there any spirits present here tonight? When suddenly something hits the tent and he freaks out. <laughs> I would have too. Finally, he decides to sleep, leaving his camera on the roll. And exactly one hour, 36 minutes later, it gets weirder. Bees for the rest of the night. Someone comes to his tent as we hear leaves rustling. This unknown person waits there for a few moments and then leaves. This could have been life-threatening, but thankfully, the vlogger safely made it out yeah, of these woods. Sure So, was it the hook man, or just another hunter in the woods? Share your thoughts in the comments. And cut off and in its place was a hook. His problem was he killed people who disturbed the Pokemon forest. And about, that's fucking great. Number six, humanoid creature. This clip shows a group of boys hanging out, but a creepy creature roams around the house. Posted on YouTube, by Reese Davis on the 15th of June, 2020, we see a mysterious creature surrounding a house. The head appears far too small and the hands too long for it to be a person. With eyes that emit light, it seems mechanical but moves too smoothly for that. This creature is so mysterious, it's hard to tell if it's humanoid or alien. The group dims their lights in the room and quietly observes. Oh, oh my God. Yo, yo. While it keeps crawling outside, the only thing keeping them away from this creature 
is the house, as it can be seen clearly from the glass. This thing keeps moving about and knocking while the boys stay inside trying to record it. Finally, this supposedly humanoid alien leaves, gladly, without causing any harm. This clip was just utterly bizarre, and the creature was abnormally long with reflective eyes. It's so unreal. How would you explain this occurrence? Is this staged with special effects or truly an otherworldly creature? Number five, Misty Woods. This man went camping solo in the trails of Quahana, North Central Pennsylvania, and shared this clip on YouTube, Outdoor Adventures, on 5th July, 2018. He was backpacking and filming himself in the dusky woods when suddenly... Frozen, and I wanted your help in kind of solving a mystery here. So the latest video that I put out, the Kahana Trail, a subscriber commented and asked me what was running behind my shoulder at this certain time frame on night one. A misty figure runs behind him and disappears into thin air. Maybe another smaller deer running behind it, but I'm... He said he thought it was a deer or some animal, but he couldn't remember hearing anything. He mentioned he recorded this video before settling down for the night maybe another smaller deer running behind it, but I'm not quite sure. Where I was camping was all completely brush. I didn't make any kind of reaction in this shot, nor do I remember hearing anything while I was filming this clip. And I remember filming it because- The woods are pretty dense and overgrown. He shows the campsite and confirms he would have heard anything passing by. Here is a little bit better of a shot so you can kind of see the open area. To the left of my head right now, that's where I walk to get... Such a chilling experience. When he posted this video, viewers spotted this mist and commented that it could be a paranormal occurrence. think it was a deer or do you agree with the other viewers let us know in the comments number four camping in the clouds this camping trip is not a usual one as it is above the clouds the video posted on reddit by swim in pavement shows a man camping at an alarming height he is seen walking up and unzipping the tent. He shows the bird's eye view from his camera and goes to check the railing. What happens next is unbelievable. railing looks rusty, but he climbs and walks on it as if walking on the floor. He is wearing a helmet, holding the camera, taking small steps about 836 feet above. Is he insane? 
insane to attempt such stunts or just incredibly brave. How did this man manage to balance at such a height? Could you do that? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Number three, night in creepy woods. Grizzly Gaz is out camping with his dog when he hears something very odd. He posted this video on YouTube on the 26th of March, 2022. He is seen having a good time until something unusual starts to unfold when the woods turn to dusk. See if I've got it. I've got it to hand. I it's in my pocket, innit? See in his pocket. After setting up his camp and having dinner, he goes for a walk. What he did not know was that he was not alone. He hears a kid's noise. Strange, right? A few moments pass and the story gets even weirder when he hears a child giggle. Come on, mate. stops and tries to record so that something might get caught by the camera, but nothing can be seen. Just wonder, what could a child be doing in the middle of a forest so late at night? I heard some kids earlier just running about, messing about. So, uh, if I find them, I'm gonna put me, uh, So could it be the spirit of a child or something else? Tell us what you think down below. Number two, creepy campsite. This clip was uploaded on YouTube by Caught on Camera TV on the 14th of November, 2020. Lexus, have you ever seen Avatar: The Last Airbender? Look at those chicken and. We see a group of friends party at a campsite, and not long before, one of them goes missing, and the rest is a nightmare. Yeah, I know. For legit though, like Alexis has been gone for so freaking long trying to actually do. Okay, but like. Okay. <laughs> It's just some friends having a good time until they notice how long one of them, Alexis, has been gone. Oh, how oh am What? Suddenly, they hear a scream and quiet down. Then one of them asks the rest of the group to come along and check up on her. They check her camp, but she's not there. <laughs> Alexis? Then they hear another scream, closer than the last one, and run in its direction. Next thing, they come across this strange hut and see Alexis injured inside. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <gasps> try to help her, but suddenly, a six-legged creature that looks like a man attacks them, and they run for their life. What kind of creature?
creature was that? Do you think they managed to save Alexis? Let us know in the comments down below. Number one, bear at campsite. Wild animal encounters are just as dangerous and terrifying as paranormal occurrences. RM Videos posted a bear encounter like this on YouTube on the 19th of October, 2020. A bear is seen arriving at a campsite while people hide inside the tent. Apparently, the bear is interested in the food and has no intention of harming anyone around. Since he doesn't bother the man standing at a distance. But you can never trust a wild animal. Let us know in the comment section. That brings our video to the end. How did you like this creepy episode? Be sure to check under your bed. Make sure to like and share the video and subscribe to Mayor Slayer for slaying content.